All right, guys, there is my barrel start position. There is my target on the side berm 10 yards away. One thing that I commonly, constantly get blown up on the, on the comments section, the recoil strap is too slow to be used in a hurry. So I just wanted to do a little timer work here to try and quantify that. And you guys can go out on your own and go replicate this however you want. Um, so I've got this full of standard velocity, nine pellet, Fiocchi, double lot buck. Uh, and I have it, what, I have it chambered, I have it on safe. I'm going to hit the green button on the beep. I'm just gonna pick it up and put a shot on that silhouette. Two oh nine to pick it up. To I didn't you saw I didn't have to fumble with the grip. It just goes right in there. And if I missed completely, guess what? You don't have to use it. You can shoot these guns without it. It's just not as easy. Well, that was with the ejection port away from me, the strap facing away from me, that was 209. Now we'll do it with that strap facing me, same exact drill. <coughs> 201. Back on safe, still double lot buck in the tube. Now we're gonna do it with this on my support side, my second weekend. Same drill. One ninety nine, still in the strap. Now we can do it on my primary weekend with the strap facing down. Same drill. 205. That's just about every configuration I can think of except for picking a gun up with a muzzle pointed towards me, which I'm not gonna do. Uh, that was using full power double up buck uh, in a hurry acquiring a target, fetching a gun. I just don't think there's a lot to that argument. That Let me know what you guys think of that. I, uh, I tried to give it the fairest shake in, in uh, a drill representation. Um, also notice I wasn't really rushing there, so I'll, I was all right, right at two seconds, and all of those were exactly center mass hits on that steel at 10 yards. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, I want to put out more content like this. If you have ideas for what you want to see, please let me know. I don't always just want to respond to the haters that say this is impossible, that's impossible, you can't do that, you can't do this. But uh, I mean, so far you guys are the most vocal viewers. So I, I um, appreciate your comments, even if sometimes they are a bit negative. Thank you.